what's up everybody and welcome back it's your boy worst effing gamer and i'm back on my other account guys we are about to awaken salas today and uh who's hyped for this man because i am super hyped this guy looks incredible he is incredible and once i is awakened he will be even better so let's go right ahead guys uh i've already done two of the easy parts for you guys this way we can get them out of the way so part one i did all of the items part two i finished his uh, title temple uh, thingy majingy so let's go ahead let's complete this guys we're gonna go right into the interesting part here and start off by doing chapter 14 without him or anyone else being killed all right easier than than ever this is too easy here so let's go ahead and let's put in uh, who are we gonna put in uh, uh rayman i just want to put in anybody let's go with you uh you oh yeah you you oh you and uh that's not a f all right so let's go ahead let's do this guys kapuya kapuya i don't fight this it's gonna be simple as hell i was born a warrior oh for real so when did you turn into a bitch ha 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 never mind that guy is really good guys so let's not insult him before he turns around and slashes through the screen and kills me how about that Alright, so I actually wish that I had this guy on my real account, my new main account, guys, because he is incredible, and I can't wait for them to release him there, because that's going to be sick to get this guy maxed out. But in this account, we're going to definitely try him out really hard here. Crush them! And we're going to see what he's all about. Testing things out in this account. Testing things out. I think it'll be a good way to test them out here. And there we go! The thrill of victory is ours! Yes, let's do it! So, finally... This guy is finally awakening. It's been too long. All right. Completion. Go. Whoa. What the hell was that? That was sick. Yo, this guy just got a really, really jumbo ass armor on his shoulder. There is nobody that can mess with that armor. That's an elephant. Holy moly. This guy's got an elephant for an armor. That is sick. Wow. Wow. Alright, I'm liking that avatar a lot, and I am really liking this. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> wow. Why is he purple in here, but he's not purple, McDurple, and his avatar? I just don't get it. Holy moly, that looks incredible, guys. So freaking sick. My god, I love this artwork. He just looks badass. Holy wow. But, like I said... Why doesn't he look green? That doesn't make no sense. Look at it. It's so much different. Will he turn green? Maybe. Want to use his ultimate now? No, oh, turn green. Turn green. No, he doesn't. All right. So let's check out his abilities here because uh, I have not finished maxing out everything else, but Oryx Rage. So last entire party will uh, have increased physical crit rate while he's on the battlefield. The entire party? The entire party? Oh my god. Oh wow. So let's go ahead. Let's do this. And what is it at 21? All allies increase physical ra rating by 166. God damn. This is phenomenal. I love this. Wow. So this guy is a beast. You know, of a DPS hero. But not only that, now he's going to give your whole team a nice aura here. So let's go ahead, guys. Let's take him to battle and let's see what those shiny elephant eyes can do. All right, guys. So since he's not maxed out, I'm just going to keep doing this in a campaign battle. I need to max him out here. So I just want to see. This is... Whoa, he took a lot of damage there. This is a pretty high stage, like I was saying. So let's see what he can do. Go, ultimate! Okay, boom. Physical attack up, guys. Wow, look at this damage. Oh, my God. All right, he turns into a psycho beast when he does this. <laughs> Yo, that's so freaking sick. I mean, check this out. You get his ultimate up, all of a sudden, his physical attack goes through the roof. Dodge goes up, everything goes up, and boom. This guy just starts slashing people down. Yo. This is insane. This is so sick. I freaking love this guy. Oh, my God. Wow. All right. So, for these waves, this is sick. Because what happens is, once he transforms, he's not transforming again. And his energy does not go away, and he doesn't have to transform twice. So, pretty much, he stays transformed throughout the whole wave. And then you can keep building up his energy. So, it seems to me he's going to be pretty cool in Crucible of Fire. 
But just to be safe, here we are, guys, in the Crucible of Fire Stage 1. I'm just going to test him out right now. I want to see what happens when I build up his ultimate here, use it, and then what's going to happen for the other one. So let's go ahead. Ultimate up. Here we go. Boom. Go now. Boom. Slash everybody. Wow. Killer beast here. Just go. Keep slashing him. Keep it slashing. Wow. You know what would have been really awesome? Oh, don't die. Don't die. Ah, damn it. He died. All right, here we are, back at it, guys. Same thing, I want to test this guy out. I really don't want him to die, so I put Nili in for a little more damage here. I didn't want to use five guys to kill him too fast. I just want to test him out. That's all I want to do. And what I'm trying to test out is the ultimate. That's all I really want. Because he could be a really sick Crucible of Fire hero, guys. So let's go. Ultimate up here. Now, boom. Let's go. Slash away. Boom. Slashy, slashy, McDashy. Uh, he's going to do a lot of damage, AoE damage, and then... And then his ultimate is going to build up. So I'm thinking if he gets a couple of kills, his ultimate can just regen. And you can keep using it every wave. So let's see if it'll work again here. Let's go. It didn't build up all the way last one, so. Go. Sylvie. All right. Ultimate. Boom. All right, so it does build. Like I said, his ultimate keeps building while he's using his ultimate. So it's a pretty cool idea. So that's kind of what I want to see. So we freaking established that already but without going too much into it. So that's kind of what I was looking for. All right, Sylvie's the beast. Let's go ahead find this guy again. So I hope you guys kind of understand what I was trying to do there is. While he goes into his ultimate rage, right? His God strength ability. Now, he's also building more energy for his next ultimate, but he can't use it on the same wave. He has to use it on the next wave, all right? So that's kind of how it works. So he does seem really awesome in Crucible of Fire. That's one thing. You can use him as a crazy DPS tank, but this guy just seems incredible in a lot of different areas that I want to test him out in. So Arena, Beast, Raises, Crit, you know, crit, uh, phys uh, Physical Crit Rating. But not only that, I kind of see this guy being really, really useful in raids, guys. Boy, I don't know why, or even Hall of Legends. I get that idea, man, raising crit and just this guy doing this insane amount of damage himself. I really feel like he's going to be good in, in, in the raids. I just get that idea, so I hope I can test him out a little further, guys. Uh, if this was in my main account, it would have been awesomely tested out at Orange, all the way maxed out. So, But for now... We're going to have to just deal the way he is. I'll test him out some more. And then we can really check him out in some live streams on the real server. Right? So, for now, I got to go, guys. I will catch you next time on another Awakening video. I hope you enjoy salad dressing here. And I will see you next time. Peace.